Hey everyone, long time no see. I hope you're all doing well. I have been extremely ill. <laughs> Let me tell you, this month has been um, extraordinary, but I'm on the mend. And I wanted to start off my video with talking about Sylvain Delacorte. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, and I'll leave all my stuff down below, uh, you will see that I had mentioned it here and there because I was testing it out. And basically, Sylvain Delacorte is a wonderful businesswoman, professional in fragrances and perfume. And she was the creative director of Guerlain, which is amazing. And um, she has developed this whole range of perfumes based on raw, a single raw material, essentially, and kind of expanded it through there. And so she's had two collections and I was sent these sample fragrances and uh, they came directly from Paris, France, all the way to New Orleans. And it was funny because at first I did not like a single one of them. I think what I was expecting was a sort of uh, common perfume scent, if you will, something that we um, all smell of and kind of smells a little bit more alcohol based or a little bit more, I don't know, just mainstream. And so I wasn't quite vibing with them and I didn't know what to do. And, you know, so I, I messaged them and I said, I don't really know. Um, this is, these are all different. And I had the musk collection and the vanilla collection, both that she had come out with. And they said, oh, you know, just try it. And don't have to say anything. We just wanted you to try it. And I was like, okay, sure. But um, you know, I'm really sorry and yada, yada, yada. So um, they come, I don't have the packets anymore, but they're little packets and I urge you to pay $4 to get them sent directly to you from Paris anywhere and um, they'll give you the collections for you to try because they are so unique and I've had them for about a good two months and um, one day I, I think I was going out and I love carrying little samples in my clutch and um, I I ran out of the ones I had got from Sephora and I just picked one up and I said, oh, I might as well, you know, it'll just be good to freshen up and smell nice. And I sprayed it on and put it in my clutch and went out the door. As soon as I got into the lift or the elevator, uh, one of the students was like, what are you wearing? That is amazing. And I actually couldn't smell it at the time. And I said, oh, I'm not really sure because I, I kind of forgot that I had sprayed it. And I was like, oh, sorry, you know, I thought, it might have been some other perfume. And then I got into the Uber and then the lady was like, oh my God, you smell so good. And this is how I can test being here what um, fragrances work based on my Uber drivers. You know, they're constantly saying that I smell so good. And every single time it's one of the Sylvain um, collections. And so I thought, huh, you know what? I need to I need to step back and maybe every day trying a different fragrance wasn't right. Uh, maybe I should just give one a chance, you know, for a week or so or a few days. So I played around. Some of them I was definitely able to tell quickly that I wasn't quite into it. The other ones, there was a good few that I really liked. And so then it, I found it quite hard to decide which one I liked. Um, but then it based on my chemistry and how it lingered through the day. And especially because New Orleans has this like bipolar weather at the moment where it can be quite hot and quite cold. And I wanted something that was an all round fragrance. I have a lot of fragrances that I use just in the winter, just in the summer, just in the spring. And it's nice. And I like that because I associate my memories and times and stories based on those perfumes. But I also want just a kind of one that just streams all the way through the year and it's kind of my signature scent or one that I can layer and I finally chose one and I, I went back to Anne who I worked with um, with Sylvain Delacorte and I said oh my god actually I really like it um, you know I, I want to mention it so they sent me the full size and a candle which oh my god the candle guys the candle but um, I wanted to show you they sent it from Paris and they sent it in this bag as if I went shopping there which how nice is that and so every time you order online if you want to give this as a gift um, you can put it in the packaging and it's just like you went to Paris to a really nice French boutique and or a perfumery and picked up a lovely fragrance for yourself or as a gift so I absolutely love that touch I think 
I'm I'm a huge packaging girl and so those little added things just make it nice and I don't if I give a gift I don't have to think about it then it came and I chose the fragrance Lily Lang which is the name I would have gone straight for it but um, I try not to look at the names and I went based on the ingredients and it's funny because I wouldn't have chosen it had I looked at the ingredients only um, so it's quite, it's quite interesting. I really, really appreciate it. It's a very bespoke brand. So it comes in a beautiful rose gold tin, like a metal tin, which you can use for storage. And then it has this beautiful blush linen finish, um, packaging like this. And it tells you what it is. And look at that. How pretty is that? If I could design anything, that's kind of my style. So I guess I must have some very French artistic vibes in me um, and then it has Sylvain de la Corte Paris and then her little logo and then at the back it tells you what Lily Lang consists of so it's Mandarin, Bayes Roses, Lang Lang, Absolute Jasmine and Benjoin de Laos I'm not sure what that part is it's a hundred mils it's just beautifully packaged and it looks like so and how chic is this it is absolutely gorgeous. I, it's one of the most beautiful perfume packaging and style and overall so elegant. And um, I love the design of the bottle. It's simple, it's super weighty, it's round and smooth, and this lid is super heavy. Um, I This weight is unbelievable. And you can see how much I use. And let me spray it again. It is just elegant. It is so elegant. And as I said, normally I would say definitely get the sample pack, but if you trust me and you like my s sort of smells, if you've, if you've cut or fragrances, I should say, if you've ever bought something based on my recommendation and you like my style, you will love this. You will absolutely love this. And it just looks so chic on the vanity. This is just such a heavyweight beautiful fragrance, beautiful eau de parfum that just stays on. And I couldn't believe it because I've never had it where I've not really been keen on something and then fallen in love with it. Um, I just had to give it a chance and it's definitely a unique, it's a unique uh, uh, fragrance brand and I love it. And I love layering with it and just getting the different undertones. And it's nice because it's not just a solid ingredient, even though it has that one raw material, and it's based on that, um, you can really smell the different notes. And I've never had that with a perfume before. So I love that. So I normally leave that on my vanity and I'm going to use the tin, obviously. I mean, how cute is that on my beauty vanity? And then they were so kind, they sent me a scented perfume. How funny is it that they call them bougie perfumes or bougie candles? So this is Solstice Debt. Um, and what a lovely, lovely box. And I can't get over this smell. And I can't get over the packaging. I've never um, gotten fancy candles. So this is my first time and um, I'm hooked. Look how beautiful this is. Isn't that just gorgeous? What a nice housewarming gift or a hostess gift. And it comes in a really beautiful metal uh, lid Oh my goodness, and this fragrance. This is what my house is going to smell like for the rest of my life. When I smell this, this is exactly what my home has to be like. Um, I'm absolutely rubbish with describing scents. So I would um, urge you to go on the website to look at the different candles they have, but this is the most elegant. And I love that nothing was broken. It was packaged beautifully all the way from Paris and just how gorgeous so this whole set and actually if you gave the perfume to the hostess you know if she's like one of your friends and this for the home because sometimes I find like the girl is my friend um but I'm going to the couple's house and although it's nice to and I always want to get my girlfriend something but I also don't want to guy the guy to feel left out so this is kind of like a good uh little thing that I've come up with that, you know, you can give the perfume to your friend and then the candles for the home, but the guy will also appreciate it. And I know guys really love candles. I didn't realize how many of them are so into it. So um, I just, I absolutely loved it. And I had to mention it because 
you know, it was something that I definitely didn't need to talk about and I've just really, really enjoyed it and it was one of the first videos I wanted to film straight away as soon as I felt better. So that kind of tells you as well how much I really love this brand. Um, I, I've i used up pretty much all the fragrances, so uh, they're all gone, um, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to buy again. Um, definitely the vanilla collection, just because I think that would probably suit me better. Uh, and I need to go back. So I don't know if that had something to do with when I was ill and my senses weren't quite there either because I had a lot of like sinus issues. So um, yeah, it, it's just kind of funny how everything turned out, but I absolutely love it and I really want you guys to check it out. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll also leave all the information down below and any uh, little uh, treats for you in terms of offers. Take care guys, bye.